Hey everyone, Joe here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to read a non-electronic caliber. Now for many of us who've seen calibers before, we are used to these digital readout ones where you just turn it on and make a measurement and there's your number. But sometimes you'll come across these kind of calipers which have no digital readout at all and they look pretty complicated. But don't worry, after this tutorial, you'll be able to read these in no time. So let's get started! The first thing you want to do is to make sure that this dial part here is on zero when these jaws are closed. And to do that, just go to this knob over here, loosen it, and rotate this dial until the needle hits zero when these are fully closed. So that is right about there. Tighten it. Now your caliper is zeroed out. Now let's have a look at the numbers on this part. So if we look, You'll see it looks kind of like a ruler. You have zero and then you have one through nine in between zero and one and so on and so forth. This part of it here are the inches. So this is one inch, two inch, three inches. And everything in between is the tenths place. So here would be 1.1 inches. Here would be 1.7 inches. And here would be 2.2 inches. To get more precise measurements, you'll have to use this dial. And all this dial does, it extends it to the hundreds and thousands place. So to demonstrate, let's just pick a random length. Let's see right here. And we'll lock this down. So if we look here, we have 2.1 and a little more. If we go to the dial, you can read it off from the nearest zero. It's 2.129. So these bigger numbers would be for example, 10 thousandths, 20 thousandths, 30 thousandths. And when this needle lands in between these two numbers, that'll be the thousandths place. So again, this would read as 2.129. The only thing tricky I can show you with reading off from the thousandths place is that, for example, let's say I just tweak this measurement just a little bit. I'll untighten this. I'm going to push this so this jaw just covers that line. Some people might say that this is still 2.1, but they'd be wrong because you don't see the, the graduation to the right of the 1. And since you can't see that, this is technically 2.0. So this would read as 2.092. And again, that's because that graduation next to the 1 is not shown. Now it's practiced by measuring a few household items, like this shrunken alien. And that reads about 2.0. Four, nine, one, or this mini teddy bear, which reads about 1.040. And last but not least, this gossip stone, which is 3.011. Thank you so much for watching this video. I want to just give a quick shout out to our latest subscriber, Troy Weggett. Yeah, I hope I pronounced that right. I appreciate you watching this channel. If you guys found this video helpful at all, please consider giving the video a like. If you have not subscribed yet to my channel and want to see more videos like this, consider doing so. And if you have any questions at all, please leave them in the comments below.